Hello, hello. Sorry for the holdup, everyone. Uh, my name is Garrick, and tonight we are sampling food chain magnate with the ketchup mechanism and other ideas expansion. We're doing the big one tonight, folks. The Henry Lowe scenario where we do every module in this book. Every dang module. Yeah. Yes. It's not entirely accurate. We don't use two of them, but that's because they don't work with the other ones. Every module we can. What's the second one? <laughs> Wait, which ones are out? The two that are out are hard choices uh, yeah, because that uses base milestones, which you know we can't use oh, old okay, in yeah. uh, and six player module. Uh, we just oh, okay. they basically just say don't play this with six players. <laughs> so wait, hold on though. Doesn't hard choices still apply to the new milestones? You just it's baked in. Them? They don't count it as a separate module. Uh, okay, that's fine. Uh, the master of pedantry who's speaking right now and who's joining me is Alan. Rude. <laughs> uh, we're also joined by Lily. Hello. And Bugless. Hey. All right. Let me give a very, very brief overview of all of the modules for everyone at home, and then we will dive into it. Uh, so first up, we have new districts, which are just some new map tiles. You can see a couple of them right now, like the apartment building and the park. Uh, the apartment building, it's like a super house. It does not have any food limitations. And whenever food is placed on it for marketing, it gets twice the demand. So it gets two pieces of food for every one piece of marketing, basically. And it is also... in the correct location. It is yep. in the correct location, <laughs> Crewmeister, just for you. Uh, <laughs> that was a not insignificant part of me choosing this map. Uh, parks. <laughs> <laughs> parks are similar to gardens in that they will increase the, the uh, value of a house. They... Uh, when it's just a park with a house, it will double the same way a garden would. But if it's a park and a garden, it triples the value, not quadruples. Uh, parks are also available as tiles, and I'll get to that right now, because the, the next module is lobbyists, which can place a road or a park. So as I mentioned, parks can be placed with these tiles using lobbyists. They can also place roads. They come on a turn delay, but they can connect places on the map. Ooh, look at that. Exciting stuff. They also come with a milestone that adds a tile to the map. It is never as impactful as you think it would be, but it's cool. Uh, we're using the new milestones, which they're, they're the new milestones. If, if you're watching this, I don't know how you don't know about them, so. There you go. Hmm. <laughs> Nobody's coming to this and being like, I've never played Food Chain before. Let me, let me find out what new milestones are. There are a whole new set of milestones, and they're awesome. Uh, next up, we have Coffee, which is maybe the biggest individual module. Mm -hmm. uh, it at, oh, Beef Hearted, you've never played Food Chain before? Well, well welcome. You chose a heck of wow. a stream to join. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good, good all luck. expansions all the time let's go uh coffee is a type of food and the big thing about it is that it's sold from coffee shops that are placed on the map and whenever a house is tracing a route to a restaurant to buy food it will stop at every coffee shop on the way and you get to sell coffee that's the short and sweet version of it Next up, we have kimchi, which is another type of food. It's this one, this sort of greenish one, right? Yes. Uh, kimchi is special in that you produce it at the end of the round instead of in uh, the working nine to five phase. And what kimchi does is uh, people will seek out kimchi I'm saying this right, right? They kind of, they go. This kimchi is the one they go to above all else, right? Correct. They want kimchi first, and it's they like will... a bonus sale. It's like a yeah, like yeah. Have kimchi and a burger, and they want a you're... burger. They will come to you. Yeah. yeah so it doesn't over everything else. Doesn't matter. Yep. It doesn't satisfy the hunger they have, but if you have the thing they want and kimchi, they will come to that place above another place, regardless kimchi of distance or real weird. anything like that. Yeah. It's weird. Kimchi and beer and co or kimchi and coke also sounds very weird. Uh, sushi, 
is the next. Well, hold on, you can also you can also store kimchi in a freezer. But oh, I wasn't. The thing you store. I wasn't going to mention that, but yes, it's very uh, thematic. Kimchi is the only thing you can store in a freezer because it is stank. It is bestank. Uh, next up is sushi. It's another type of food. Sushi uh, replaces other types of foods for sales purposes. So if they want a burger, they can accept sushi instead. And they will, uh, what is it? They will look to see if they can get sushi before the real food, <coughs> right? Houses with gardens. Yeah, it's just Right. Gardens. Uh, so houses with gardens exclusively will look to replace the thing they want with sushi, if possible. The total amount, always. The total amount, yeah. So if they want two burgers, then they can accept two sushi instead. And they will seek out the two sushi over two burgers, but only if the house has a garden. Uh, the counter to sushi, sort of, or the, the foil, is noodles, which also replace foods, but they will be sought out after the food that they are replacing. So if somebody wants two burgers, they will only go to the two noodles if nobody has two burgers. Hmm. This applies for every house, though. Nobody's too snobby for some ramen. I am. <laughs> the next module is ketchup, which is purely a milestone. And it just says that when somebody sells your demand, i.e. when you marketed to a house and then someone else sold that house, uh, the person who marketed gets that milestone and they will just have minus one distance for their route calculations for the rest of the game for uh, dinner time purposes i should maybe clarify it's good and scary and easy to forget uh fry chefs is the next module fry chefs uh where are they here they are they just add a bonus 10 bucks per sale and if that sounds wacky to you it's because it is Every single house that you sell will get an extra 10 bucks on top of it. It's, uh, it's powerful. People like french fries, apparently. Unaffected by distance. Uh, yeah, I don't believe... It's just a bonus on top. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, it, you know, luxuries managers, you actually have to contend with other people marketing or trying to use up your demand yeah it's like luxury without having to compete it's i don't know the one time we tried it i kind of hated it but who knows six of them and their limit <laughs> billy i don't like french fries i don't like food oh man french fries are I'm, the best i'm gonna play all six <laughs> I've, I've i've taken years off my life for the quantity of french fries i've eaten in my, i i my do time. admittedly like mcdonald's french fries but that's because they have like beef tallow or whatever in that stuff <laughs> it's not it's not the taste of potato which i don't like anyway the next one up Potatoes. is oh my god i know uh the next one up it's, is night shift manager it's a special like clone what's that you're supposed to be my clone oh i'm what sorry bug this we, we split dna there I guess. yeah food is a thing with me uh night shift manager is a special a executive type of employee so it takes up one of your top rank slots and can't be subordinate to a manager but what it does is it makes all of your employees who do not require a salary all of your basic bitches uh work twice it's very cool next up is the mass marketeer it's an upgrade to the marketing trainee and it creates an extra marketing phase this turn. Just a whole extra marketing phase. We're getting crazy here, folks. <laughs> uh, after that is Rural Marketeers. Rural Marketeers add a rural zone over here. It has an infinite uh, potential for demand. Uh, and it can only be advertised with to with the rural marketeer who will put these permanent billboards next to it that will advertise to it. And there is a milestone for the first rural marketeer used that creates a freeway on ramp. And this is where the rural zone can come onto the map and seek out a restaurant for food. So it's sort of creating a special demand zone that 
you also get to choose where it comes on. It's weird. Next up, we have the Gourmet Food Critic, which markets to houses with gardens. It's, it's for your, uh, your classic snobs. He tells them what to eat. We have Movie Stars, which are an upgrade to the waitress, and they allow you to win all ties and get first choice in turn order if you have the B-Movie Star. However, you'll notice that there's only one of her, and then it's the C-Movie Star. The C-Movie Star wins all ties, but loses to the B-Movie Star and gets second choice in turn order. And similarly, there is a D-Movie Star that works as you would expect based on those. We are playing, uh, finally, with the Reserve Prices module, which we've been playing with for every one of our games in this series. And what they do is they add a flat 200 to the bank when it breaks, but they change the base price of all goods in the game starting the round after the bank breaks. They can change it to either 5, keep it at 10, or change it to 20. So yeah, that is all of the modules, and we're using them all because we're crazy people and we're playing the Henry Lowe scenario. So Fuglas, would you like to lay out the turn order yeah. track and we can dive into this? Oh goodness, I think this is a bad thing. Okay. All right. Where should I place my restaurant? Uh, Ellie and I were talking a lot about up here earlier just for the silly drink location, but I don't actually think I want to do that. Hmm. Man, that was a lot of talking. <laughs> uh... I think I actually just want to come up here. I didn't realize you were so boring, Alan. Oh. <laughs> 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 hmm. What's that? Uh, in chat, Lily mentioned that I beat her earlier, and Billy was like, "You what?" <laughs> oh well. We were playing a, a board game. <laughs> I just forgot about context, and that's fine. I mean, you did have him in a box, so that's true. Uh, like, who beats who it's here? A balance. <laughs> All right, I'm done. Okay. Lily? Ah, yes, me. Choices. Um. Uh. <sighs> hmm. <sighs> Come on, Lily, we're not even playing with hard choices. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing to think Everything about. Else. There's no hard choices in this game. <laughs> uh, actually, I think I want to go here. I thought you wanted to go up here, Lily. I did originally, and now I'm thinking I want to go here. But thanks for offering. 
<laughs> Final choice? <laughs> Final choice. Oh, good golly gracious. I love how we always plan for managers, but then we never actually do them. <laughs> I mean, I guess we did in the last two games, but we were also playing with the old milestones. Well, Garrick, you got a pretty easy lockup on Pi if you want to go over there. Yeah, that's certainly the tempting choice. Apparently, Lily and I are in contention for something. Are we? Potentially. Depends <laughs> on what you. De it depends on what you do. Not a great drink route up there, fortunately. Hmm. Well, just build a road. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. Or, if you don't want to screw up your billboards, there's that. <laughs> I think that through... Is the range on those guys? Uh, of course it is. I think if you go there, you're one, two, three, one, two. If you go through there, you're actually equidistant to Lily to eight, which means the only thing you've got locked is Pi. That's a little awkward. It is a little awkward. Maybe I do go here. Then I'm blocking the park. That sucks. But if I go up here, I block potential marketing to eight and Pi. Urg. I mean, that looks good to me. Puts me at distance two from Pi, one from eight. But that's me market to Ooh. both of them. Well, Thugless is one, two, three, four, five from Pi. Yeah. Lily is one, two, three, four from Pi. <laughs> I'm five, I think. We'll go with... Oh, my God. I hate it so much, though. Dude. Do it and get wrecked by managers. <laughs> um, I wish maybe go here. Oh my god, I hate this so much. Oh boy. Well, that's not a legal spot. No, it's not. <laughs> Sorry, I'll I'll stop talking. I'm not actually being helpful. Oh no, it's okay. It's okay. Keep taunting him. It'll be fun. It's not. <laughs> hurting my thought process. My thought process is just slow and circuitous. <sighs> Alright, we'll go with that and I'll be unhappy. You're the last person to place a restaurant. That's normal. I know. I know. Okay, uh, first round. We all play CEO. Uh, first we choose reserve cards. Oh, you're yeah. right. We haven't done that. Oh my lord, I haven't chosen my strategy yet. Well, yeah, Cooperage. That drive-through was why I was thinking about moving over here. I don't know that it's actually really helping me that much to scoot over like that, and it makes my drink route more awkward. I think. I think this is maybe the better thing. I don't know. See what happens. Uh, yeah. All right, I've chosen. Garrick? I will go first. Really? <coughs> I want to go last. Okay. Right, 
I'm going to go marketing. Okay. Recruiting girl. Marketing. Recruiting girl. Ah, no trainers. And I tried so hard to make a map for him. All right. Oh. So we, we still put an X over first trainer used because it can't happen. Yeah. There's not enough turns, right? It is. First trainer used is gone. Okay. All right. Well, Derek, you are. Oh wait, we're into a new one, aren't we? Yeah, we're into a new one. Uh, everyone has the same amount. I will choose to go first again. while I have it? I'll go second. Okay. Uh, I play a marketer. I get first marketeer used and first marketing trainee used. Excuse me. So I get a free kitchen trainee and errand boy. Give me them kitchen boys. Uh, let's see. Let's market ourselves. Is 13 the one we want? That looks like the one we want. And we will market limonade. Surprise, surprise. Hello. All right, hires. Oh, right, I have a hire. Uh, also, you get a kitchen trainee and a drink. And yeah, I did boy. grab. I did grab those. I just forgot about my hire. Uh, seems, seems seems important. It does seem important. And goodness gracious, it's been so long since I did new milestone marketer that I don't remember the strat. Uh, well, you did lemonade, like right? So that's good. Um, it's recruiting girl, right? It's a recruiting girl or trainer. This turn, I can hire. Trainer ends up being so tight. Right, that's what I thought. It's I'm pretty sure it's recruiting girl. Gosh, I'm rusty apparently. All right, my turn is done. Okay. Um. So I will just do two hires. So I will hire a waitress. What? I know it's it's weird. I don't know why I have to. Why I wouldn't ever do that. Um. <sighs> Now, this is kind of the divergence point, though. This is the question mark. I think... Yeah, I know what I want to do. I just can't really support it yet. Maybe I just get a second recruiting girl, honestly. Since it won't really matter for next turn. No way I sell either of your things. Hmm. 
Okay, actually, hang on. Uh. There's a thing I want to do, but I don't do it because Lily can just beat me there. That's mm -hmm. sad. Don't worry about it. I'm not going to say it out loud. <laughs> I think... Uh... Yeah, I think I just hire a second recruiting girl and move on with life. Let's go. Oh, damn it. <laughs> damn it. All right, fine. Sad about that. <laughs> okay, so I clearly want to uh, I'll get my my dude. Oh, yeah, you I need to get that too. Yeah, you should get your dude. Um... And then I'm going to recruit a waitress and an errand boy. Yeah. So I, was, I wasn't thinking about the fact that Fuckless could double market. And I was thinking if I went double errand boy to try to get pie, that you would just beat me there. That's fair. But it's probably what I should have done. Speaking oh. of marketing. Should be another extra one on pie. Uh, you're totally right. Thank you. Got you. All right. So Gary uh, gets 15. Fuglas gets 10. All right. That, oh, don't forget to take your boy back. Okay. And then we're on to the next round. All right, everyone ready? Ready, ready. Yep. All right. Lily and I are tied, and then you guys. Yeah. So you want first? Uh, yeah, I'll it? go first. Yeah, Alan gets it. I would like second. I'll get third. Okay. Alan, take it away. Okay. It's going to be a uh, night shift manager. And oh, how are you paying his Got a waitress. I, salaries? That's I right. have a, I have a waitress. The trainer salaries are three dollars each. Yep, yeah, and the waitress, the waitress makes three dollars. Uh, well, doesn't this guy cost money, or is he free? He's free. He's free. Uh, nice. Oh. Hmm. Do I just go go with a second trainer? No, I get another waitress, I think. All right. I'm good. Lily? Okay. Uh Sorry, Alan, can you just remind me what you hired? Night shift manager, trainer, waitress. Okay. Uh, I will also hire a night shift manager. I thought you were going to say all three the same. <laughs> hmm. I do not have two recruiting girls, so I will not be doing that. But I will be getting a trainer. Um, actually, no. I want to get... A recruiting girl. Really? Uh no, no. I mean, you gotta take take advantage of that trainer. lemonade bonus. I'll do the trainer. Um, I keep forgetting what night manager does. I'm just like, yeah, he's good, but I completely forgot what he can do. No, he's good. He's and broken. I will grab <laughs> a lemonade. Okay. Is he 
Is he broken enough to make up for the fact that I'm the only one who doesn't have the lemonade milestone? We will see. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm going to make a lemonade. I'm going to mark it. What do we want? Probably beer. Let's mark it a beer. And we will hire a trainer and Two, three. I guess a management training. Can't fit anyone else. Done. Yeah. Feel like I'm making a mistake, but I don't know what it is. Um, lemonade, manager trainee, um, lobbyist. Oh boy. All right, dinner time. Dinner time, starting with house pie, apartment pie. Nope. No one's got it. Uh, moving on to house eight. Uh, I have a lemonade. I am the closest by all measurements that I can calculate. So I will sell it for $10. Same, 15. Yep, same with 15. And then Lily gets 25. And she I gets get it. Ketchup. Oh, you get ketchup. Oh, mm -hmm. lordy. But I got twenty dollars. <laughs> and you got the most broken milestone in the game. So. Oh, this is not good. Uh, yeah, I I definitely needed to do double Aaron Boy on my first turn. Uh, so you took gonna put me so far behind. forty from the bank total bug list. It's correct. It's okay. at 65. We all have 65. That's fine. I just was checking with you. I know, I know. I'm uh, trying to keep track. Uh, okay. Then we move on to payday. Anyone have payday they have to pay? Yep, five. Um, I'm just paying with my waitress, so just don't even. Yep. Me too. And then we move on to marketing. Uh, 11 goes first. Ten bucks for Fugless. Then thirteen. Fifteen bucks for me. All right, fuck up. Marketing is done. And we move on to the next round. Everyone ready to go? Ready, ready. Yep. Okay. Uh, who has the most slots? I have six. I have a seven. Uh, seven. Lily, yeah. would you like to go first? Yes. I would. Alan, would you like second? Yes, please. I would like third. There we go. Lily, take it away. All right. What the hell am I doing?
Okay. I want to... What do I want to do? Things and stuff. <gasps> what? All right. I'm going to hire a management trainee, a marketing trainee, and a kitchen trainee. My three. Uh, I'm going to... Uh... I think I'm going to train up my marketing trainee to a rural marketer. No, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to keep him. Actually, I don't want him. <laughs> I'm so decisive. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, give me a second while my brain works. Do I have to? No. So I'm going to get a second kitchen trainee and train them up to a pizza cook. And then I will train my management trainee up to a new business developer. Mm -hmm. um, um, oh, should I have five I hires? <laughs> You have five hires? Jesus. Yeah, that was me last game, which is why I was like, oh, wait, maybe I don't want the second recruiting girl. Well, I figured, it, I figured it offers a lot of flexibility, if nothing else, and I didn't have anything more valuable to do that turn, except I actually did. I should have done two errand boys. <laughs> Whoa, now. Whoa, now. Are you done, Lily? Yeah, I'm done. Cool. Look at you selling stuff like you have a business <laughs> uh, uh, all right i'm gonna hire a trainer i'm going to hire and train a new business developer i'm gonna hire and train a barista and i um things <laughs> i have two more <laughs> You know that uh, think, saying things is not a get out of jail free card to just be done with your turn. You have to actually do the things. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> I think waitress just is extra padding that I might need. And let me see. Do I want? I suppose I could go management trainee just to have the one extra slot for all these people that I'm hiring. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't hurt me in any way to have him. You can always have a business, boy. Oh, you know what? I'm being dumb. At this point, I definitely need to, like... Yeah, I'm being dumb. I don't want a waitress. I probably... Uh, I think this is the turn I go double Aaron boy, as I should have done previously. All right, that's me. That's all I get. Okay. Um. I'm going to hire my management trainee and train it up to a new business developer. <laughs> and... Uh, the fact that you can get that and lemonade is... No trainer player in this game is making this a weird game. Yeah. Yeah. Train-based gameplay, we have reached the apex. This is every single module. There is no further insanity than this. Uh, fuck this went lobbyist. Ooh. 
yeah, Mike, this, this hiring tree is insane. I'll get another <coughs> management trainee. Uh, Aaron Boy will get me a beer. Uh, marketing trainee will market. Surprise, surprise. I really need all those. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, American trainee is going to market. Burgers. I'm feeling the slot limit right now. <laughs> okay, I'm up. You go, Fugless. You're up. Uh, trainer. Oh, first lobbyist is out. Yep. Um, I will not be able to get first burger. Um, another kitchen trainee, I think. Or maybe two trainers. Yeah, two trainers. Um, <coughs> um, marketing. Aaron Boy, lobbyist. What? I can't believe it. Oh, hold on. I can't do this. Yeah, that, uh, that doesn't go there. <laughs> you do have to actually connect to a road somehow. Oh, that's right. Oh, shit. I didn't think about that. Wait, I can mean, I place my road first? I was going to say, yeah, what, do you have, what are you using lobbyists for? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Okay. I don't believe that's legal because you're not placing it to another road. I think that it has to connect two roads. Let me look. Well, rip the dream. One of the arrows has to point to an existing stretch of road or your restaurant uh, entrance. This is oh, one it of only, the arrows. only one of the arrows. OK, yeah, uh, then okay. you can do it. You are breaking up your your cool yeah. marketing thing, but yeah, maybe I just want to put it. For each of the arrows that point directly to an existing road square, place a roadworks marker on that road tile. During dinner time, each roadworks marker adds plus one distance to your route. We didn't do that before. I Wait, no what? what the words you just said were. Uh, if I'm reading this right, basically what these do is they go here. Oh, Jesus, what? And adds a plus one distance while it's there. Oh wow! Well, but I mean, it would really go away eventually. Because he's. Yeah, I just I just realized that something we definitely didn't do last time we used lobbyists. Oh, meaning this mm -hmm. is? Are you saying this is accessible this turn? No, no, no. This is still not accessible uh, yet. It just it also adds. So uh, this is here forever. No, no, no. When this, when this when this at the end of the round this will go away and that'll flip. It's just this oh, round. It Oh, it's just saying that there's like road construction here. So, yep. like, if I was trying to sell, okay, I, that seems so weird that that would ever come up. But I guess right. in the game, it might. Yeah, it's. I mean, it's like it's a pure thematic thing, basically. It's technically having a gameplay effect, but is it really? Uh, <laughs> you know. <laughs> hold on, I can't put a park. I thought the I thought there was a smaller park tile rip. Um, so I, this could be another argument for using lobbyists aggressively, right? Yeah. Is, like maybe that's something that comes uh, into play in the future. Okay, hold on. Actually, what happens first? 
do I use lobbyist first or I mark it first? Because that is a... you definitely mark it first. Lobbyist is like uh, okay in between houses and restaurants, I believe. Let me double check that. Used after houses and gardens have been placed and before new restaurants. So I could just say screw it and just mark it here. Billy, Henry Lowe is one of the playtesters of this game. I don't know why the scenario is named after him. Maybe he came up with it. <laughs> Maybe he said, hey, what if we do all of this together? The designer's like, what is wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> so that, that's, a silly, that's a silly thought there, Fogless. You shouldn't do that. <laughs> Problem is I won't sell. Oh yeah, I won't sell the burger if I do this. Rip. Um. Why? Oh yeah, I will. Never mind. I'm stupid. I'm just... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but no, I really, I, I'm, I'm growing more and more in this thought of aggressive late game lobbyist to screw up maps and increased distances at, at key points. It almost feels like that should just be its own separate thing. Like, right like there's a, a road repairman uh, employee that you can send out to do that. <laughs> um, I need this guy out here. Yeah, actually, that's interesting. There's not very many employees you can get that actively impact your opponents. Like, managers do, in a way. And pricing managers and discount managers do in a way, but that more affects your own restaurant and what's it what it's doing. There's no like corporate sabotage in this game. Yeah, it's all indirect. Are you reading that this is still legal, even though this yeah road yeah yeah that's that's like, legal yeah even though this like it the... it doesn't matter it can connect okay. anywhere okay just making sure um okay uh, dinner time so eight. <laughs> Garrick, your beer, I assume? Uh, yes. Yes. And I don't think... Then what's My beer, then Lily's beer. Thank you. So, Garrick makes... You each make... T we each make 10. She yes. makes 20, so $40. Yep. And then we get first beer sold. Correctamundo. Oof. Then marketing happens. Poor apartment pie is never going to be fed. You don't know so that. You get 15, I get 5. Correct. Oh, I forgot to place my coffee shop for training a barista. Mm, oh, yeah. Very important. Because right, and... there were some food deliveries, so. Uh, gosh. I wouldn't have come down here without all of that information as much but as I now want not to gonna, do it. You're not going to sell any coffee. You're just going to put it. But you should try to I play, mean, you should try to play honest if you didn't if you weren't originally planning on going down. No, there. exactly. I mean, I my goal is to get one near uh, everywhere, but I was probably going to start here, frankly. I take it back. Play dishonest, go down near Fugless. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I may not sell it any of this. I may be just marketing to it. I may just say screw it. Either either way, that's that's this is the more honest play, so I'm not I'm not gonna uh do, do you and Lily make any waitress money and like all that garbage? What's your no. uh I I earn three dollars. I don't I I <laughs> I hit two of my executives yeah. with my waitress and one of them got a beer. <laughs> uh, don't forget that this executive is free. No, I know. I've got three. <laughs> got all these people here. Mm, you do. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So one of well, them I... was like, beer is delicious. Fugless, I owe the bank five bucks. Uh, okay. Oh, Lily, you getting that one errand boy is going to be the reason I lose this game. And it's making me real sad. I'm sorry. No, it's fine. It's my own stupidity. I should have known what uh what Fogless was gonna do. Don't forget to remove your billboard, <sighs> Fogless. Mm, actually, do I want My to what? Them? Your billboard. Oh billboard. We marketed. Yeah, sure, We're done. Not. I'll play play her. Uh, 
All right, I'm ready when y'all are. Ready, ready. Um, yeah, I'm ready. Looks like we're waiting on Alan. Sorry. That's okay. I was Good. just debating if I... Oh my god, I'm going to have to move this somewhere. <laughs> uh. I have one slot. <laughs> I have four. Oh wait, what am I doing? I don't need to play these Aaron boys. I have three slots. I'm an idiot. Lily, you, you going four. first? E. I on second, I'll go third. I'll go fourth. Yep, yep. Okay. Take it away, Lily. All right. Um got three hires. Let's hire three trainers just because I hate all of you. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Will I use them? I don't know, but I'm taking them. <laughs> uh, I, mean, I will I, use. I like your think. I'm going to use my trainer to train up my Aaron boy to a card operator. Uh. So that gets me the, is that the, yeah, that's the first card, card operator uh, mm -hmm. used. So now, stupid amounts of lemonade. <laughs> uh, so that's going to be two doubled. So four, eight, 12. Okay. And then we'll get four. Um, I guess I didn't need to play my pizza cook because I thought I would need extra food. So whatever. I'll just have the stupid amount of food. Um, I regret losing card operator. And I get two burgers from my kitchen trainee. And um. let's put out this house over here. In this corner. 19. Well, I like it being 19. Actually, I'm going to put it over here. <laughs> yeah. Kay. I want to put it there. That makes more sense to me. Okay. Um. Did you, did you, did you, did you? Yep, we're good. I'm done. Okay. Uh... So I think that, oh Jesus, I have four trains and five hires. <laughs> All right, let's get two coffees. Hopefully I sell them. Um... Yeah, I'll sell one of them for sure. I think that just to lock the spot, I need to mm. Gosh. Training to barista is just not a good play for me. Because barista and he does exactly the same thing for, without a salary. Sorry, I don't mean to be slow. It's okay. Uh, I'm going to hire and train B Movie Star. Let's get that out of the way. Makes sense. Uh... Just remember, you can't spell slow without low. Like Henry Lowe. It's a joke. And uh, hire and train a luxuries manager. That's the correct response. <laughs> and then... Shoot, maybe I just go... Bust out three barista trainees. That's probably too aggressive, though.
Let's get another two trainers and let's get Iron Train at Junior VP. So I've only I still have one train left. I don't know that I use it. One, two, three, four, five, six, and I'm making twelve. I have three banked, and I'm gonna sell at least a little bit of coffee here. Maybe I need another waitress. And put one trainer back and get a waitress. Um, I'll train an errand boy into a card operator. Won't get the bonus rip. Yeah, that's how I feel. I mean, it's fine. I'm next to Lemonade, at least, so... Like, I can I can still make this work if, it, if and when it's ever needed. Um... I think I just give up on that. Yeah, no, I I don't know why I'm doing that. I'm not gonna I don't wanna have to pay him. Okay. All right, so I am going to I'm going to get a card operator uh and I will instead of the second waitress I'm going to get a kitchen trainee And let me see here. So I, who did I hire then? You know what? I can live without the junior VP and I'll get a second kitchen trainee instead. Um, yeah, so my final hire list, sorry for this, is two kitchen trainees, a waitress that I trained to a B-movie star, a management trainee that I trained to a luxuries manager, and a third trainer. And I trained my card errand boy to card operator. I love that you're mousing uh, over these things like we can see them. <laughs> it's fine. But I did five <clears throat> five hires and three trains. That's what's that's what's relevant. Yep. I'm uh, killing one of my trains, which is a little sad. Um, also, I am... Ugh. No. This is... This is rough. Uh, I'm going to skip on this trainer and get a barista trainee instead. Because I need to start... Uh, I need to start making more coffee. All done? I still need to place my house for my new business developer. And... Um... I think I want it up here. I don't want to make the plane any better than it already is, so I got to be a little cautious about where it goes. But I think for right now, I just want the accessibility of it. So 
So we'll do that. And that is the turn. Sorry that took so long. That's okay. No good. So I had plenty of time to think about my turn. I didn't, but I had plenty of... No, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's get the new business developer part done just so I don't have to think about it. With the rest of them. No, <laughs> thank you. Uh, is that where I want to go? Ooh, this is interesting. You're giving Lily potentially yes. access to it if she ever gets the rest manager. I mean, I still technically have access just because it goes up here, but not as much as he does, so. Yeah, Garrick's still a minus two, so. Yeah. Also that. I still feel pretty good about it. Um, yep, so that's that. That gives me first house built. Uh, kitchen trainee is going to give me a burger. I'm going to... Hire two trainers. Uh, we're going to train up marketing trainee to a campaign manager and use it. Getting oh, no. first campaign <laughs> manager used. You're going to get eight off of this. Nine, actually, because of the apartment. Uh, don't forget, it's going... Oh, no, to... ten. It's ten. Wow. Don't forget, I'm going to put out two of them. Well, that's what I'm saying. It'll be one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. Assuming you go to the same spot twice, but I don't know why you wouldn't. Uh, maybe to mess with Bugless. True. You'd lose out go on some it. revenue. I need free marketing. <laughs> Um... Just remember, at the end of the day, this is not a game about selling food. This is true. You're making everyone hungry. That's all. Ah, uh, he'll get next round. I may as well make the money I make. Let's advertise Coke, I think. Lily is card operator. Where is she? Right here. Yeah. So she can she reach can... it. Mm, Coke? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Down here she can. Also over here. Yep. Mm. Yeah, that's a thing. Maybe I do something else. Make food. Lily has a pizza cook. All burgers all the time. This is an important decision that I did not think through. Well, the bank's going to bust this around 100%. Yeah. Uh... No, I don't want it to be Coke. I had all this time to think. I know. I If Lily's going to get a freezer, I want her to earn it. 
Um, I will earn it. <laughs> Iron all the things. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's not not looking great for me. We've got card operator. Yeah, let's make it burgers. I'm not going to sell these things. I may as well make them harder to sell. Okay, I've decided. All right. I'm going to hire a manager trainee and train him to new business developer, manager trainee to junior vice president, uh, make a burger, and that's it. Okay. We go to dinner time. We start with apartment pie. Nope. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, Lily got it. You made that. Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, Lily might. Yeah, this is going to be hard now. That's uh, uh, $60. Yep. Yeah. Two mm. bucks left in the bank. <laughs> yeah, Lily's in a strong position. Yeah, a bunch, um, of, bunch of my hires are totally pointless. Then eight. Uh, I've got a burger, and I'm right there. That's 10. The bank busts. Uh, Alan also sells a coffee on the way. So that's... Oh, wait. Uh, I also sold coffee at Pi. Oh, you did. So both coffees Another got $10. sold. Okay. So 20 20 for me. Yep. And the base price is now... And I also get first coffee sold. Uh-oh. Uh, which breaks what happens the... then? Uh, let me check. Let me check. <laughs> Garrick, thank you for doing the right one. <laughs> of course. <laughs> 20 wins over 10 and 5. 5 wins over 10. No! We lose, Fuglis. Yeah, we lose. <laughs> Wait, what is it? It's 20. Yeah. Okay. Starting next round. Oh, well, GG's. GG. <laughs> I tried. I do need to think about uh, where to place my coffee, coffee shop. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Lily. Kind of. Although I don't know what this arcane rune is here. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's an arcane weird. rune. <laughs> um, it's we, a curse we, told, the table, we already obviously. we already did this burger, right? Oh yeah, we did. Sorry, I forgot to take it off the map. And then I'll do this one. Uh, Crewmeister, it's not over, but it's over. Fugus and I needed the base price to change to five to have a chance. Now Lily and Alan are the ones in contention to win. Hmm. We'll see. I think I think Lily's got the infrastructure to kill me on this. Yeah, Lily had a killer she, setup. She did that awesome thing she, she did, always does, where she played reactively to the table. Ugh. And now F Fugless isn't even bothering with marketing to his own areas anymore. Um. Uh. Yeah. Good point. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, it's kind of pointless to market now because it's only five dollars. I mean, it's not so, pointless, but I get what yeah, you're saying. Yeah, it's not pointless, but yeah, exactly. It's like... Cause... So, if I... Remind me, if I put this coffee shop here, it's then accessible from that road. Does... Do eight and three... Eight and three would not go to it, or they Eight would? would. Three could not. Because three would have to double back to hit it. Oh, because eight can theoretically leave from here. That's yep. why. Eight can leave from here. Just go whoop, whoop, whoop. But three would have to go like whoop, whoop. And that doesn't work. Yeah. I blocked so off the other prime get it coffee off spot of... intentionally. Yeah. No, that's fine. I mean, you needed to get three on the park. Yeah. Uh, I don't hate this just because three, because pi scores so early and it's going to get scored. I guess it might not if no one actually goes Burger Chef. Did you just do this for a single turn, Garrick? Yeah. So these are actually They haven't uh, they haven't marketed yet. Yeah. You know what? This is fine for now. Uh I'll live with my choices. Uh do marketing, Garrick. You figure out where they all go. Uh payday first, technically. Oh yeah. Uh, I'm gonna fire this card op operator. Don't know why I bothered. Mm -hmm. um, I, I wasted a lot of my value this turn. I'm gonna lose strictly because of this turn. Uh, I owe five bucks to the bank. I will add it myself since you're. Oh, you're you're good. Yeah, uh, go ahead. Okay. Yeah, do it. 
Sorry, I'm I should have gotten I six from waitresses. Someone. Uh, yeah, I should have gotten six from waitresses, and then I'm paying everyone in food. Okay. Uh, so let's see here. I get four from waitresses, and then I spend one, two, three. Here, let me think about my structure. Four, five. Five. Yep, that's fine. I'm gonna take care uh, of everything. So I I lose three dollars, Fogless. So three dollars goes back to the bank. You mean? Correct. Okay. <laughs> if I need to it's worth keeping a lobbyist at this point when the game's going to like end so fast all right i marketed 10 you marketing 10 marketing. things so uh 50 bucks yeah 50 bucks and i'll take it from the bank mm. do we have one round left or two <laughs> it ain't gonna lie, it ain't gonna last long. I would guess two. That's kind of what I'm thinking too, but I'm not certain. It would take a heck of a turn to to empty the bank. It's possible though. Nothing's impossible when you have friendship. Or maybe it was horseshit. Yeah. Oh wait. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna fire this new business developer as well. I don't. I don't need you. Uh, so I'm gonna get my three dollars back because <laughs> it matters okay. so much. Hmm. You know what? I'll fire the lobbyist. I don't think it's gonna come into play. Uh, let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 11. Is there anywhere it might matter? I suppose it. You know what? Fuck it. I'll play. I'll play him just in case. Oh boy. Yeah, the twenty dollars definitely. I'll do what I can, but this game's <laughs> this game's over. Yeah. Uh, slots. Four. P movie star. Yep. So also we're gonna that. go, Alan. I'll go first. <laughs> Second, Lily. Yep. Oh, slots. I have. Um, I actually have one. Then you beat me out. Um. I'm going to go last, though. Okay. Uh, Alan? Um, I'm just debating what's more valuable. Uh, I think I'm just going to say F it. And, uh, I'm going to hire and train a CFO. Uh, so that's one hire, and then I'm going to hire four barista trainees. <laughs> uh, gosh, I could get a little more coffee if I just had one more train. I can't train on the job anyway, so it doesn't matter. Uh, and then I will produce four coffees and two burgers. Oops, that's one too many. And am I doing anything else? I don't believe so. Pretty sure that's it. Really? Um. Okay, I am hiring a management trainee and two waitresses. Um. I will double train my management trainee up to a CFO. 
or yeah, whatever. Quadruple uh, train, you mean? Quadruple train, yeah. I will double train this kitchen trainee into a burger chef. And then I will train... Oh, that's why. I wanted to get... Sorry, I wanted another management trainee. Um, I'm training this pizza cook into a fry chef. Oh, boy. Mm. And then I'll use my last train on the management trainee to go to a just a junior VP. All done? Yeah. Uh, well, let me grab all the food. Other yeah. than 6,000 food, yeah. yeah. All the all the regret that i have uh i'm gonna double train my kitchen trainee up into a burger chef i'm also going to train my campaign manager into a brand manager I like you're still sticking to it well may as well go down with the ship right <laughs> uh new business developer is gonna throw a house there. Um, burger Chef's going to get me eight burgers. Uh, let me just put my airplane down while I'm thinking about it. Oh, that doesn't quite line up the way I thought it does, huh? Can't hit pi and me. three. That's unfortunate. Yeah, you can. But pi and O three. Oh, it no, cuts off. Yeah. I thought they overlapped. That's okay. It's yeah, really not, but double, that's okay. What are you double marketing? Um or two goods, I mean. You can market yeah. two different goods. You don't have to, but you can. <sighs> well one might as well. One side's going to be burgers. The other's going to be... Maybe I should have tossed some effort into noodles just because. <laughs> it seems seem so, like, on paper, it's like, oh, I'm going to, there's going to be demand left over, and then, like, you play it, and there's never demand left over. There, there like, never how is. How is that possible? I know. I went noodles last time and hardcore regretted it. Lemonade. Lemonade. What are you doing? What do you mean? What am I doing? Oh, uh, rip! I guess Lily's gonna get all that. I mean, it's like she's gonna get it anyway. This I mean, way, I I can at least I can train up into a truck driver and also potentially sell some of it. True. True. That's my thought process. Oh no, I get, I get you. I mean, I will, um, I will field better advice. I mean, I can't complain because I need folks to sell stuff in order to sell my coffee. It's just that my coffee is not going to be enough to keep up. My hire even, will be God. a management trainee, and then I think each I'm of done. these coffees is going to earn me forty-five dollars. <laughs> Once the CFO is online, I mean. All right, Fugless, you are up. All right, I think I fucked up. I think I forgot. It's been so long since I did this marketing strategy. I think I screwed it up. Um, we'll uh, discuss how much I just fucked up in a second. Um, um, I mean, I didn't. I didn't totally fuck up. I'll at least sell something. But yeah, I think I fucked up. Okay. Um, I will. Um, Did you see Crewmeister's comment? What? Yeah, it's funny. <laughs> My coffee is um, not going to be enough to keep up. Is what I say every exam season. Hmm. Um. See, I was higher. 
I was not in a hard science, so I didn't have exams so much as I had like 50 essays all due at the same time. Mm. And uh, yeah, that that's about how that rolls. There's any purpose to any of this? Um... Oh, fuck this. That's a deep question. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's okay. It's your last we week. Going, You're free after we this week. The meaning of life. <laughs> It's mm. 42, right? Uh, yeah, really. Mm -hmm. Why didn't I sell that right. damn lemonade in the first right. turn? Yeah, giving Lily the access to the lemonade was a big mistake in my book. I should have um, I, sh I should have seen it. Oh, well. I'm going to hire last because I'm not sure what to do anymore. That's fine. Um, I'll build a house. I'll just build it here. Yeah, I think I. it's been so long since I did the marketing thing. I just realized I can't train a guy two steps because... You can only do that if you have the house built. Yeah. First house built, right? Okay. Yep. Whoopsie. That's why I, I, I will train for this it. guy. I will train this guy into a sushi cook. I was hoping to get sushi chef, but I realized I can't do that now. Oh um, gosh, I didn't think about sushi. I know. Y'all are like, I'm like, sweet. That's why I wanted to last. I was like, if y'all go, if either of you go sushi, then I'll just train my marketing guy up. But then I just realized I can't do two steps. I will train him up to a campaign manager, though. Fuck it. We'll just throw some more marketing out here. Fuck it all. Um, <laughs> nice. See, now you have the all, attitude. All y all, all, y all need to sell stuff so that I can sell stuff. That, that's, um, that's where this goes. Where's the, where's the, mo where's the best uh, mailbox spot? Is it just where you had it? Yeah, it's where spot? I had it. Okay. Uh, can you reach it? The distance is three. Uh, One, three. two, three. I can go here. That doesn't, mm. that doesn't work. You can go one, two. You can go up here. Yeah. How many does that hit? It hits all the same ones. Hits yeah, 19, it nineteen, three, eight, even better six, because five. Of six. Yeah. Um, let's just fuck with everybody's plans and just do coke. Coke. Um, and you know what? Let's just do it for max duration because we're never gonna. We don't. We don't have. Turn. We don't have There's more than like two turns. Two turns yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I so I will be very surprised if the bank does not break at the end of the following round. Same. Two sushi. Um, then I still have the two hires. Uh, and no trainers. So let's just um, let's get another kitchen trainee. Let's just get and another trainer. Goodbye, trainers. Yep. Hey, so uh, random question. Why does it, pie only have two burgers on it? Shouldn't it have four? It does have four. Oh, uh, it does have four. Look at that. <laughs> All righty. Uh, let's sell some food. So first up is three. Yep. They'll eat my sushi. Screw All right, you. And I, I will sell <laughs> one coffee for $30. Oh, wait, no, it's a, it's a garden. <laughs> Oh crap! These are forty How dollars affect? each. I just got. It's on a park and it has a garden. Uh, oh shit! That's a hundred. So wait, how then? does how does luxuries manager interplay with the multipliers there? Uh, the bonuses. Oh no! Uh, luxuries manager adds to the price, so those get affected by the garden and the park. So six might break this turn. Actually, <laughs> is that a sixty dollar coffee? Oh my lord! Is it really? Three times fifteen? No, that can't be right because it's it's well, three no, it's, times the base. The base price is. Oh my 30. god, the base price is twenty, right? Oh my. No, wait, no, it's it's ninety. It's a ninety dollar coffee. Oh my god! <laughs> it's a $90 oh dear. <laughs> so ninety, and the burgers were two burger. They were sixty dollars each, right? They're triple because of the park. Yeah. All right. Oh yeah. dear. <laughs> well, at least I'll, I'll have a respectable score, at least. All right. Um, next up is Pie. That's Lily. Is She's, that... Oh, no. Al, you have burgers. Okay. Yeah, I have burgers. So that's $80. Yeah, this this is yep. going to break this turn. Uh, I so I, I'm going to sell two yeah. coffees, which are only worth 20 each this time. I'm sad about that. Uh, they're worth or more than 30 that. each. 30 yeah, each. So, so $60, $60 for my two coffees. Okay. Um, oh god! Next up is eight. God, I would have won if I had kind of gotten a sushi chef. Maybe. Uh, I've got two. I think I'm probably still closest. 
that's mm -hmm. and it's just there's no garden so it's yeah so it's just 40 bucks yeah and then i also that. sell my last coffee for 30 dollars yep okay uh and then 19 i think that's uh, that's gotta be you. alan wait alan. no i have the oh, no, luck cruise manager yeah Oh, never mind. Yeah, so super... it's definitely me. Yeah. So that's yeah. forty dollars. No, uh, I played the... so it's forty. It's a garden eighty, and then plus ten for my fry chef, so ninety. <laughs> There's hundred and fifty one dollars left. Damn, Garrick, two forty five. I actually, with my minus two, I actually am the same distance as you for that. It's just you went for the turn order because you don't have your waitresses out. Wow. Damn. Wow. All right, that's it. This. Salary time. Salary time. Salary. <laughs> I pay him. All right, hold up. Firing my, my new business developer. Yeah, who am I firing? Uh, actually, I don't think I fire anybody. I think I have to keep all these jokers. I fire uh, my new business developer. All right, so hold on. One, two, I owe five to the bank. Four, okay. five. Uh, so I lose three dollars after waitresses. Okay. Little lady paying with food, I assume. Yeah, I paying food. All right, I'm marketing. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot about mar my marketing guy. I owe an extra five. Oh, yeah. This might break because of... Mar uh, uh, oh, did you add another five to the bank for me? No. Okay. All right. Do, you do marketing, Garrett, and tell me how much money it is. <laughs> it might literally... There's 174. It's going to be close. How does that work if it breaks during marketing? I don't know. We'll find out. I think it might not break, but we'll, we'll find out when we get there. One, two... I think, it's, I think 174 is a little too high. Three... But... Four, five, six, seven. So it's going to be fourteen. So fourteen yeah. times five. That's seventy. So yeah, it's not going to break because I only get fifty. But it's definitely breaking next turn by a lot. Uh, how much was it? Uh, fourteen what? times five. That's how much? Seventy. Seventy. And then mine, do mine for me. Uh, let's see, remove the piece, and it's going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. That's it. 30. I mean, this is probably the most competitive game so far, even though the high, the index scores will probably be like way whacked, but at this point, it's at least like. Our scores are close. All right, so we have 74 in the bank. Um, we do it again. Yep, we have 74 in the bank. Yeah, Lily. Yeah. I mean, I, I think like... between Lily and I with the CFOs, I don't. This is going to uh, be yeah, a yeah. silly last round. Yeah, that's true. Y'all are going to explode. Also, you guys threw marketing all over the map. Oh, I guess it's less. It's not so much. Um, hmm. You know what? Gosh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play a trainer. Oh, wait a minute. I had. I had first beer sold and I had two burgers left over. I'm sorry. Uh, I need uh, 10 bucks out of the bank. Okay. Because I paid two people with money that I didn't need to pay. Hold up. One, two, three, four, six. Hmm. You know what? Do I need the movie star at this point? I don't think I do. I'm gonna fire the movie star guys. <laughs> uh -huh. Five more dollars. Or three dollars. Uh three. Well they just they don't make a difference because I'm not actually competing with anyone for distance. And I guess turn order maybe, but not in this round. Turn order's not gonna matter.
<sighs> I'm ready whenever y'all are. Same. Yeah, I'm ready. I have zero slots. <laughs> um, I have one, two, three slots. I also have three. I have six. So I have seven. <laughs> All right. So Lily first, then myself, then Fogus, then no, Alan. Alan's going first because he's the movie star. No, he got rid he of it. Uh, oh, he got rid of it. Never mind. Yeah. 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 I don't know. Maybe somebody will tell me later it was dumb, but it didn't. It doesn't actually I don't matter. Think it matters. We'll, we'll probably find out in a moment. All right, Lily. I'm gonna hire a waitress. I'm double training my card operator up to a Zeppelin pilot, and then I'm gonna get a crap ton of food. <laughs> You're hiring a waitress? Yeah, because I can. <laughs> <laughs> it's not gonna matter, but it's the principle of the thing. I get um, it. That's cool. I'm just gonna go ahead and get my twelve coffees. One, two, three. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, 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 yeah, so it's just one, two, three, four. Um, and then I think I get a crap ton of burgers. Yeah, one more. All right, I'm done. Okay. Um, I'm going to train my errand boy up to a truck boy. And I'm going to get eight burgers. And my truck driver is going to go past this Coke up here, over to here. So one, two, three. And I'll get uh, 12 lemonades and three Cokes. I'm not hiring anyone. I'm just training a sushi cook into a sushi chef and a kitchen trainee into a sushi cook. And making seven sushi. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, that's gonna that's gonna hurt. Is it just me? Uh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh so I produce twelve coffees and then I am going to hire and train a barista, which will allow me to place my last coffee shop. Uh so a question on that point. So if I put a coffee shop here mm -hmm. and Fugless sells house three, does this coffee shop trigger? Nope. Okay. That makes this a more difficult question. It has to actually pass it on the road. But I don't know why yeah. you would ever put it here and not just put it here. That does make a lot more sense. Thank you. You're welcome. Because <laughs> somehow being across the street is more convenient than like next to it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, you've seen these busy like two and two side roads. You definitely want to have to stop on one side of the road and then go across the road and go to the other one rather than going to the two next to each other. It's so much more convenient. Totally. All right. Well, good. anyways, uh, that's that's all I'm doing. Okay, dinner right. time. Uh, house three wants Coke. I have sushi. That's $60 sushi. I won't bother with the bank. Yeah, it's, um, it's fine. Pie. Hang uh, on. Uh, before that, uh, oh, yeah. house three, I sell two coffees on the way, and yep. what do we decide? It's ninety dollars each. Yep. Uh, so that's a hundred and eighty dollars in coffee for me. Uh, and I need to track my CFO separately. Okay. I put way too many garden houses out and crazies. Um. Next is pie. Uh, I have all of the goods for that. Uh, okay. Uh, yep. So it looks like I get it. That's how many? How many goods was that? One hundred twenty dollars worth. Right. Uh, and I. Douglas, you have six sushi. Like they only want gardens. 
Oh, you're right. That's right. That's right. All right. I will sell two coffees to Pi um, for a total of $60. Uh, there was six things on there, so it's 120 Is that right? Yep. Mm -hmm. All right. I paid my food and everything. Uh, six? Six. I have three sushi. Okay. And I sell two uh, for 60 each, so 120. Why only two? Uh, oh, Fugless. Oh, Fugless got it. So yeah. three, so 180 for me. Cool. I love how they stop for coffee at each stop. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> it's pretty funny. Um, <laughs> eight? Yes. It's not me. So. Uh, I have each of those components. So that's eight. a normal house. So yeah, that's just 40. 60 bucks. Oh, sorry. Yeah, so 60. that's one coffee to me for 30 bucks. Uh, two coffees. Is it, it two? It can hit this and this. Remember, it comes out up here. Boop, boop. Oh, yeah, you're right. Uh, thank you. You're welcome. Oh, shoot. How do points. I? So 60. Coffee broke. Coffee is indeed broke. Uh, but just doesn't make sense. Like it needs to say you can't use luxury manager or something. Because why would you not just go coffee and not? I mean, the then you just get fry chef and everything's still broken. Uh, nine and three quarters. Uh, not me. I have the components. So Lily also has the components. Who's closer? I have to actually math. One, two, three. Four versus one, two, three, four. I've got a minus two. So that probably goes to me. Wow, okay. okay. So, all right. Uh, so I, I sell my last two coffees uh, to nine and three quarters. That sucks. So 60 bucks. And I get 80 bucks for selling four things. Um, and then 19. Yep. Oh my I've, God. My I've end score is going to be stupid. Um, so that's just a garden, so 40. <coughs> and then I have two more sushi for 80 more. That worked out nicely for you. All right. And Bank is broken. That's dinner time. We need CFO payments and waitress payments, and then we are done. Yeah, well, Alan has so like a thousand. I know. Oh. Alan's about to like double us. Uh, and then so five fifty two divided by two, <laughs> uh, two fifty two seventy five two seventy six I believe. Uh, five fifty five fifty two is what you made. Yeah, two seventy six. You're right. Yeah. Okay. I broke oh. a thousand. Oh, yep. Yep, you did. <laughs> nice. Yep, you did. And you damn near doubled me. Holy mm. shit. I mean, he quadrupled me, so... <laughs> so the, uh, the night shift manager comboed with Barista is broken, as, broken AF. Yes, yeah. I see that. Yeah, the, I should each, Every Barista trainee being two coffees <laughs> is dumb. <laughs> So Alan won with one thousand thirty-one dollars. Very I mean, impressive. I feel like you could make coffee interesting, but yeah, it's like the fact you can just sell it at ten dollars each with no rest like there's no way to stop it because like they're gonna hit the coffee shops no matter what. So yeah, it's not like I can sell coffee over you. Um, it really does feel like coffee should just be like a fixed price and not be affected by like price changes and and yeah, all that right. stuff it should be just coffee is permanently five dollars that's it or something like that mm, that would make it a lot weaker yeah but the problem is to make coffee work at all you have to go you have to go hard into it right like you can't really diversify and in fact the mistakes that i made in this game was trying to diversify yeah, um, that was my biggest thing. I think i just kind of didn't really i should have either gone for better distance or like like Alan did with 
or um, follow us with sushi or barista just kind of having more it's options. Interesting, though. We did not see any hard marketing with Mass Marketer. And maybe that was because of Garrick, well, I was, I was gonna Garrick's go Map Marketer, Spawn. But then I realized the game was going to like end so fast. It's... I don't know. It's maybe I should have tried for mass marketer, but I was trying to keep up in other aspects of my structure and like didn't really have time to hire another marketer and train them. I mean, I don't really feel like you need to though. Uh, <sighs> like I, I feel like you can just train up your first marketing trainee the whole game. I guess you do then have to hire into a mass marketer. Right. That's, the problem. That's what I was saying. And it's hard because yeah. it still runs into that limitation of, you know, uh, houses have finite limits. So, like, I'm effectively adding the two locations with the marketer. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's weird. Yeah, I mean, gardens at least have the have the max out at five. But, yeah, I mean, you definitely do. It is a diminishing return after a little bit. Maybe if I could have also hit three with my plane, it would have made more sense. But I, I also, I also will say too, if you're just going mass marketing and you're not selling anything, that's one less player selling stuff, which makes coffee weaker. Yeah, that's true. I, I wonder if I shouldn't have sold things, but then it felt like Lily would sell everything and just explode in value, and you would still get the coffee. You know. Yeah. I don't know that there's a great counter to coffee. Every time coffee's been in the game, it's dominated. Yeah. I mean, I think the worst it's done is just when we all went coffee and had to compete with each other a little bit, right? Yeah. And like, I that's... will say, having like the prime picks on every coffee shop location because nobody else was doing it. Right. Exactly. Like, it feels like the only counter to coffee is to also go coffee, just to deny spots mm -hmm. to other people. Yeah, it's weird. Which honestly, if that had happened, I probably would have tried to go into manager. But God, even like by the time I could train into manager, but like I got new business developer as quickly as I thought I could, and then I only got one turn to use him, mm -hmm. and that was the turn to get the CFO. That like that's the thing. This game just ends so quickly with the new milestones. Yeah, mm -hmm. so quickly. Well. A good chunk of it was the twenty dollar sale price. Let's not fool ourselves here. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, I I threw that in knowing from yeah. the get go that I needed this to be a fast game. No, yeah, absolutely. That was fun though. Yeah, it was good. We I really used, liked we Henry a... Lowe's. I'd almost like Henry Lowe without coffee just to try it. Yeah, I really like coffee. It just, I don't know how you... It's so unbalanced. It's, it's just hand. very oppressive, I mean, yeah. I mean, it's, I, it literally is just because there is no, like, denial system. Yeah, like it, right. And mm -hmm. it, I've, played, I've played other games that have this kind of, like, a system outside of the outside of the market that just earns money. And it's always, in every game like that, it's always broken. Yeah. Like, if everyone has to compete except the one idiot who's, like, off by himself selling to an international market or something like that, which is the case in Arkwright. Like, I broke Arkwright. <laughs> <laughs> My friends won't play it with me anymore. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, anyways. Yeah, that was Henry Lowe. We made it through... All, how many scenarios was it? Uh, a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine scenarios in catch-up mechanism. We made it through them all. Uh, and we are done with food chain for a while. As humorous as yeah. it is, Crewmeister, we are not going to work backwards through the chain of scenarios. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Outside of uh, Gloomhaven and Twilight Imperium, this is now probably the single most plays I have on a game, which is weird. Oh, that's a good point. This this is probably up there for me because I've played it a lot in person, too. Huh. Uh, so, yeah, thank you guys for playing. 
Uh, thank you everyone for watching. We will be back with a different Splatter game next Sunday for the first time in months. We're free. Uh, it'll be exciting to get to some other titles. I've been wanting to badly. And I know Drew said he was interested in trying a couple of the other ones. He just didn't want to play more Food Chain. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we, we had the consistent group, at least. Yeah, yeah. No, it, it worked out well having, you know, us four every week for this. So it was, it was a good thing. Yeah, Roads and Boats is high up there, Crewmeister. Roads and Boats, uh, Indonesia, and Great Zimbabwe are the three I most want to play. Uh, Greed Inc. is probably, like, right after those three. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Uh, we will catch you next time. If you like what we're doing, like, comment, and subscribe. And have a great evening. Thank you.